Hello again, it's those Gilderies, and today we have special delivery. So let's see what we got this time. So we already got the summer box, so this would have to be the fall box. Falling apart box. <laughs> no, it's not falling apart. Yep. It's the fall box. Fall into delicious recipes. Wait, you have that to get food all over you. Collapse. So first, we have the recipes. They usually give us some recipes. So we have um, fluffy biscuits, chocolate peanut butter mug cake, sour cream pumpkin cake, um, pressure cooker saucy barbecue chicken, cranberry pecan pie, Sausage stuffed acorn squash. And the best ever lasagna recipe. <laughs> okay, so then let's see. Merry Christmas, you got your lasagna. So there is a bonus item in there, but that's not that. Okay, so that was just the cards. Okay, go ahead, Chris. Spatula? No, yes, spatula. Spatula? It's not quite a spatula, it's a spatula. <laughs> function, style, and reliability. Stainless so, steel. What's the difference between the spatula and the spatula? Just because it's tiny. Oh. They show lasagna on. Is it for like getting lasagna out of the pan, I guess? <laughs> I guess we can probably not use it. Not dishwasher safe. This is not a toy. Keep away from children and pets. It's not dishwasher safe. How sick. I mean, oop. <laughs> <laughs> what? Sick. You know? So I guess this would help you get the lasagna out of the pan. I'm confused. Sick. What? Sick. <laughs> How could they do something? I didn't mean that. It was an accident. <laughs> okay. Go ahead and read about the... Okay. <laughs> okay. I mean sad. How sad, not sick. How sick. So this is... Um... Joey, Stina, Steel, and Silicone Turner. <laughs> You may think you don't need a mini turner, but once you start using this, you won't want to be without it. The angled head makes it the perfect tool for flipping eggs or silver ball or pancakes in a skillet, especially small skillets. It also allows you to easily get to the bottom of foods in a pan, like brownies or lasagna. Because it's made of silicone, it won't scratch nonstick coat cookware bakeware or appliances, like a waffle or a panini maker. Plus, the short handle and small angled head make the tool both functional and easy to use. But it's not dishwasher safe, so that means that you can't it use it for hot stuff, tip. right? Uh -huh. Use this right size turner in place of a kitchen knife to spread softened butter onto Italian bread pops for garlic bread. Grip the spatula at the base of the handle and press down with your softened butter. Using the back side of the spatula, it's, yeah, spatula, simply spread a wide layer onto bread. Instead of many passes, you've got the butter spread in just a few. This also works for spreading peanut butter or jam onto bread quickly and efficiently. Yay! It works as a spreader. <laughs> spatula. spatula! Okay. <laughs> Taste of home bros. Taste of home bros. <laughs> no, no, silly voice item. Huh? Yeah. Oh, okay. Bonus item. It's right there. Bean tested coffee. 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 So some coffee. Taste of home roast. I think we've got a pack of that. Cool. Yeah. Yep. Bonus item. What surprise will you get? You've added a little something extra to your special delivery box this season. And maybe our subscriber exclusive taste of home roast coffee, which it is, or a subscriber favorite from a past season of the box. Whatever surprise you get, we hope you enjoy this added bonus item. <laughs> the coffee feet. Oh, crap here. My nose. Okay. Microwave mini bunts. So these are little bunt pans, I guess. You can Make your own little cakes in the microwave. Yep. Okay. 
I don't know if we would really use those. I mean, we don't usually make that from microwave cakes. <laughs> <laughs> I guess we're people who want to make microwave cakes. Yep. Nordicware micro mini bunts. I've got nothing but love for these little guys. Sorry, I couldn't resist because it's true. When I'm craving something sweet but don't feel like getting into full baking mode, I make a mini bunt cake in the microwave using a one cup mug recipe like the one we've shared or a mix. In just a few minutes, I'm able to indulge in the perfect me time dessert. Also, just in case you're wondering, the cake, the cakes hold the pattern of the pan nicely, which makes them, makes them as pretty as they are delicious. Next thing we got is a silicone pressure cooker rack. Ideal for roast poultry, fish fillets, and vegetables. Elevate food above fat and liquid in pressure cookers, slow cookers, bakeware, and more. Yeah, we don't have one of those pressure cooker things. They assume everybody has one. It's <laughs> a new thing that everybody we must have. The pressure cooker. Where's the paper in my face? Look at everything. So this is the Oxo silicone pressure cooker rack. Or is it OXO? <laughs> I have someone called OXO. As big fans of OXO products, we predict that the 7 inch silicone rack will get tons of use in your kitchen. Not only is it great for keeping foods lifted out and out of liquid and fat in your pressure cooker, slow cooker, and bakeware, which means healthier cooking, it can be used as a sturdy trivet too. Our test kitchen team cooked meats poultry, whole chicken, chicken breast, fish and veggies, corn on the cob, potatoes on the track. It was thick enough to support the weight of each of the items tested, and at one inch tall, it kept the food sufficiently elevated from the liquids. When we used an electric pressure cooker, we found it to be less bulky than a metal turbot. And because it's made of silicone, nothing sticks to it. This makes cleanup easy, both in a dishwasher or by hand. And they, they say that you should use it for the saucy barbecue chicken. Yeah. Well, we do have a slow cooker, but it's like already full enough. I mean, it's small to begin with. We don't want to put that on the bottom of it. Artisan baking toy, the toothbrush is cute. Oh, so it looks like a toothbrush. They put me on it. Just <laughs> That's not. Okay, so it came a little bit unstuck. Oh no. It looks like a toothbrush. I'm the cleaning tool. <laughs> okay, and then there's a pick for your teeth at the bottom too. See? Oh, so it is a toothbrush. It's a toothbrush. Oh, look, look, it's even got that so you can get the corners of your mouth. No, yeah, see there's a little pick right it's there. perfect. And then there's a thing for the corners of your mouth. <laughs> <laughs> Somebody actually tries to use that as a toothbrush. Right? Yeah. Ew. <laughs> well, at least it's clean, so it's not like it's been used yet. Let me use it and then brush my teeth with it. Oh. Nordic Wear Ultimate Buns. Cleaning tool. We love fun pans. Their intricate and beautiful designs result in stunning desserts. But getting all those nooks and crannies clean and crumb free can be quite a daunting task. Not anymore. Thanks to the angled brushes with stiff bristles, the flat scraper and pick on this gadget, you'll be cheering along with all the air buns bakers for your ability to reach all those tight crevices. Recently, our culinary team baked almost 40 bunt cakes for a future cookbook. This essential tool saved us tons of frustration and cleaning time and it didn't scratch the surfaces of our gorgeous non-stick pans. Mm -hmm. This kitchen tip, get extra mileage on this tool by using it to clean hard to reach areas of kitchen appliances like spiralizers and gadgets like zesters. Oh yeah, that would come in handy. Also, you things on the use it to clean your teeth after a meal. It might be good for the strainers too when they get things oh, stuck in yeah, between them. Trouble that could actually today. come in handy. <laughs> Okay, so the next thing we got is a cookbook, a big, heavy cookbook called um, Farmhouse Favorites. So you can send you live on the phone. Yeah. <laughs> it tells you how to skin your own chicken. I'm skin. Oh, God. So, Asiago mashed cauliflower. How to kill your chicken. Yeah. 
Deviled eggs with bacon. Uh, let's see, sweet onion bread skillet. Ooh, it smells good. I love the smell of the book. <sighs> okay, chicken nectarine and avocado salad. So they got a whole bunch of cool recipes in there. I heard chicken neck. <laughs> well, they, they actually do have some things about the farm. I don't think this tells you how to kill your chicken, though. <laughs> How to kill your chicken for the recipes. Okay. Where's the book? Oh, is it just on the front, I guess? Maybe? Oh, okay, yeah. Taste the home roots are in the heartland where fresh fruits and vegetables and abundant dairy and meat products can be procured from farms just a short drive from our Milwaukee test kitchen. We love using farm fresh ingredients in the recipes you share with us. So think of Farmhouse Favorites, the cookbook in, the, in your Fall 2020 special delivery box, as our tribute to the family farmers across the U.S. who work so hard to put delicious foods on our table. In addition to include 142 recipes that are pure country comfort, the cookbook is sprinkled with charming photos and heartwarming stories that honor and celebrate life on the farm. Speaking of country comfort, biscuits are a dinner time staple in my home. You can now make them in up to three sizes with your good cooked biscuit cutter set. Oh wait, oops, I'm going way too far ahead. <gasps> okay. Spoiler. <laughs> Next, Chris. Okay. Good cooked biscuit cutter set. Okay, so we had a set where you can make different sizes of biscuits. When I make regular biscuits, I usually use a cup, but actually this would, quite rings. this would probably be more use more better than using a cup to make the biscuits. Two and a half inches, two and three fourths inches, and three inches. I need to have the instant diameter because you can put up in lazy lately, so I don't make regular biscuits anymore. I just buy them frozen and put them on the thing. All the people who love making biscuits are horrible. Ah! Or make the drop biscuits, which are easy to just drop it on there and it turns into biscuits. So this is the good cooked biscuit cutter set. <laughs> Nothing beats a tender, flaky, homemade biscuit served next to a steaming hot bowl of soup. With five or fewer simple ingredients and a really good set of biscuit cutters like this one, you can make the best biscuits ever. I like making jumbo biscuits with scalloped edges. With this set, you can chew from three different sizes, and because these cutters are reversible, you have edging options, straight or scalloped. <laughs> scallop biscuits. Scallop potato biscuits. Oh! <laughs> wow. oh. <laughs> okay, so there's one thing left in the box. All right, got measuring cups. Those are always useful. Yep. Four pieces of measuring cups. Oh, those got pouring things on them too. At least one of them does. Yeah. Oh yeah, they all have little the pouring things on them. Okay, so we got some measuring cups with little pour spouts. That comes in handy. Okay, so oh, here they are. Oh, they're bamboo cups. Don't break them like my coffee cup. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. They're dishwasher though, right? Otherwise, I'll scream. This popcorn <laughs> set stacks well and nests so conveniently. It hardly takes up any room in a kitchen drawer or cabinet. We love that the unit and measure is permanently embossed in the bottom of each cup as ink printed markings tend to fade over time. These also sit sturdily and won't tip over. And the one side indention allows you to grasp the cup comfortably and confidently. It doesn't say anything. Yeah, that. you can put them in the dishwasher. Okay. You just can't microwave them. But you have to be careful because one time I put something in the dishwasher and it said dishwasher safe and it broke. Yep, that happens. And I'm like, oh no! Yep, sometimes I'll say that and then you, know, you put them in the dishwasher and oh, I guess that wasn't true. But then they replaced the entire set so that was nice. Yeah, with the cat bowls. Okay, so um, if you like this video give us a thumbs up and if you have not already for more of our unboxings please subscribe to our channel and we'll see you guys later goodbye Bye.